right, I'm going to show you how to graph a square root function, square root of x, and then we're going to transform it using h of x here, negative sign out front, and what happens if we add a 7 to the x inside the square root. So the first thing I want to show you is what does the square root function look like? Well, every square root function simply looks like this. It starts off in the origin here and shoots up to the right into quadrant 1 like so. So this is our f of x function. This is what the square root function looks like. Based off of that, let's see if we can go and graph this transformation. A couple of things going on here. One is that plus 7 that's inside of the square root that is directly affecting the x is a horizontal shift. So this thing here is going to give me a horizontal shift. Horizontal shift. And this negative sign that's outside of the square root that's not directly affecting the x but outside of the function is a reflection, right? It's a reflection over the x-axis and that's also important. Okay, so what does this new function h of x look like? Well, first off, the reflection, the reflection, if I was to graph that, let me, I should do this here. Let me draw the original function, what it looks like. The reflection over the x-axis is simply kind of think of it like holding a mirror on the x-axis. If you were to hold a mirror right here on the x-axis, then the reflection would look like this. I'll draw it in red for you. Okay? So this right here, this reflection is coming from that negative sign that we just had in our h of x function. Now that horizontal shift, let's handle that last. That horizontal shift, even though it's kind of counterintuitive, even though you see a plus 7 and you might think it actually moves it to the right 7, uh-uh, it actually does the opposite. It moves it to the left 7. So it's a horizontal shift to the left 7 places. And now this red function has been moved over here, and it looks like that. So this one was the reflection. That's the horizontal shift. And what, I sh what I'm showing you here in blue, or it looks kind of dark blue, uh, is, the, is the h of x function. So the blue one here is h of x.